something came to my mind today and it was something that someone did wrong to me. At that time, I was upset and when that thought came to me, I don't believe I was trying to think of it. Like, as it seems, it came to my mind randomly. Why? Like, I am not trying to think about what that person has done. And I believe it was something I already accepted. So if I accepted it, and if I wasn't trying to think of it, why did it come to my mind? I believe that thought came to my mind to get me upset at that person or probably whatever did it probably was trying to get me in a upset mood or some type of bad feeling mood. For what? What if I chose to feed in to those feelings? What if? Let's say if I were to feed into those feelings. I think at times some people may overreact to something that you have done. Not so much what you have done was really bad. Maybe they were dealing with something else. That is what I believe. So, what if I would have fed into those feelings, then go out and treat someone wrongly, then that person goes out and treat another person wrongly because of me? Am I the only one having these thoughts of the past like bad thoughts of the past like what use is there to constantly think about the past what use is there to remind yourself or feed in to those type of feelings if you understand what I mean. Now, I believe it was a demon or demons who gave me that thought. Even if a thought comes to my mind, I believe it is my choice to entertain it or not, right? What if you had a thought to eat worms and caterpillars and to eat mud? Are you going to entertain those thoughts? What if a thought came to your mind to do something let's say to eat rotten eggs are you going to entertain that thought if no then can you say you have the power to reject thoughts just because a thought keeps on coming to you over and over again does it mean you have to be accepting of it? Does it mean you have to give in to it? Does it mean that you have to do it?
Obviously not, right? If you can reject eating dogs or worms or rotten eggs, can't you reject other thoughts as well? I am not going to be mad at that person for what that person has done in the past. Why? Because the past is the past. I have done so much wrong in my past. So much wrong. And I believe I want mercy for what I have done in the past. So if I am crying out for mercy, shouldn't I be merciful to others, right? Why constantly think about what others have done to you in the past when you are continuing and have done wrong in your past as well? Think about that. You are constantly doing wrong, but you are constantly thinking about what others have done to you. How? How strange is that? How strange is that? I guess when you first get hurt about something, I guess it is normal to cry about it or be mad, upset, or whatever. But after a while, I think you need to let go, right? I'm not saying you have to give that person some tea and eat some biscuits with that person. I am not saying that. I am not saying you have to be their friend. I am not saying you have to buy them a scarf. But let things go. Someone has done something wrong to me. It, it bothers me when the thought comes to my mind. You know, will I let that person get in the position to do the same thing to me again? Probably not. But as far as I know, I believe I have let that go to where I don't have any hatred toward that person. I don't believe I have any unforgiveness for that person. So pretty much what I am saying to you, we have to let things go. Stop thinking about the past. Stop thinking. I think some people are addicted to emotional pain. I think some people find comfort in feeling hurt. How strange is that? How can you feel comfort in feeling hurt? Like, I think with some people, I think with some people, they may like watching certain types of TV shows. Like, that may give them pleasure. Likewise, I believe there are some people who like feeling pity for themselves, like feeling hurt and crying, like, do you understand what I mean by this? Stop doing that. That is not normal. I believe that is demonic. Let things go. Let me stop here. God bless you.